All right guys, so welcome back to Car Combine. I'm Keegan and we're on day three of LA. So we're headed right now to the Porsche Experience Center. Then we have a private tour of the Peterson Museum and the vault below. So follow along and stay tuned for what we see. All right, so we just arrived to Porsche Center LA and check this out. We've got the 2015 919 Le Mans hybrid race car. It's all dirty, probably still from the track day. This is beautiful, wow. All right, so we're just gonna do a quick walk around of the gallery here at Porsche Center LA. So we've got a 718 Cayman T. We've got this PTS olive green 911 Turbo S cab with the exclusive wheels. This thing is beautiful, great spec. Then in the uh, service shop, if you know, you know, 935. That thing is beautiful. It's got the Coke livery with the Domino stickers. This thing is priceless, literally priceless. And we've got a 996 cup car. Oh, no, wait, this is a GT2. I lied. <laughs> 996 GT2. <sighs> if you know, you know, again, the Marlboro livery GT1. This car's worth, it's priceless, really priceless. And this is one of the Le Mans winning engines back in the 80s. That thing is so cool to see. But right here, we have a GT3 RS with a GT2 RS front bumper, but this one, Pikes Peak last year. These things are so cool. The whole cup car is all done up. Then we've got the actual GT2 RS. Wow, just beautiful. Came third, right? Yeah, this one came third at Pikes Peak, so got two winners right here. Well, two podium placements. Then we've got this, the 911 Targa Heritage Edition. It's got the corduroy interior. These things are beautiful. Look at the paint. So they're making 992 of these. It's got the number 50 on the side here and check out the interior. It's red, tan, it's the corduroy interior. It's beautiful. Uh, right next to it, last week, I wish you were here, um, we had a 935. No way. Yeah, and it was no just way. all carbon fiber. Um, they only made 77. The new generation? Yeah, the new generation. Okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. Only made 77, and we actually had two of them in here at one time, no which is unbelievable. <laughs> um, yeah, but the other one just left us, so I think it was yesterday or the day before. Yeah, but again, gotta... we get so many amazing yeah. cars in here. This is an engine from um, uh, a 962 that won Le Mans in no uh, 1986. It's just recently won, so this won first place um, at Pikes Peak, and that won third. So, and we have that, our heritage um, uh, Forest Targa over there too. Cannot be ordered any longer, but they, they didn't make a limited number, but they could be ordered for an amount of time, but they kind of mixed in like the 50s, 60s, and 70s into this heritage model. So if you go look inside, it has like the corduroy interior, um, this, like the, the Porsche and the Targa are in gold. You know, a lot of just the uh, elements from the past years. So pretty, pretty awesome to see that too. And now we just had we had a session just go out at 11 a.m. So that'll be out. Th uh, they'll be out there from 11 to 12:30. So an hour and a half. So I host like a car club back in Windsor, and we just had a track day, and uh, we had like a couple GT3 RSs, GT2 RS, mm -hmm. so a bunch of cars, and we got to ride along in them. And like, wow, it's just unreal. <laughs> yeah, to <laughs> it's be amazing, in that man. RS, right? It's yep. just incredible. <laughs> Incredible. Yeah, the GT2 RS is just handling like nothing else. Oh, it's, it's unbelievable. Yeah, that, we do a Porsche owner experience every oh, Thursday, nice. uh, last session of the day. So um, owners that have uh, Porsche models 1990 or newer okay. can go out on our course. To oh, okay, 90 no minutes. Way. So we just started that, I believe, last summer. Okay. It sells out every Thursday. Um, really? Just to <laughs> see all the different models and the years, because you know our fleet are, is the new yeah. uh, models. So uh, to see like you know GT2s and just every model come in, okay, it's yeah. so fun. We just had oh, it yesterday, yeah. so every Thursday. That's gonna uh, be so awesome. So it's very popular, yeah, it, it's a lot of fun. It's our retail store. Um, Atlanta and our location are the only two uh, retail stores that carry all three lines of Porsche Brown in one place. Okay. So uh, uh, Porsche Design, Porsche Driver Selection, and Porsche Museum. So lots of fun stuff in here. Uh, Porsche Museum, we get items that come directly from Stuttgart that you oh, wouldn't okay. find in other uh, places. So just, uh, yeah, wow. a nice mix of, again, lots of fun stuff, all the martini livery stuff, yeah. and um, yeah, all the great models. I just got the Coca-Cola RSR. Oh, nice. Yeah, I just got this one. 
And this one actually was over at Porsche Motorsport a few months ago. Oh, so no So I got way. pictures of that in person. So now this is on my desk. <laughs> the RSRs sound crazy. Oh, oh my God. gosh, it's so great. Yeah, and just to see them in person, I just couldn't get over yeah. it. I was like, and it had just one, I believe, Le Petit Le Mans. Oh my God, that's... Yeah. With the I mean, Coke livery that's... too, that's so cool. <laughs> So as you can see, a lot of times they just have all different models over there. Yep. Yeah. And uh, I get to sneak in once in a while. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky you. Now we have two dining options here. We have Speedster Cafe. Um, Chef also oversees the cafe. So it's a lot of grab and go items, Starbucks coffee, and a wonderful large outdoor patio area um, to enjoy the view. And also we do a lot of events mm -hmm. that will uh, you know, use the space for their events. So it's, it's a really great space. We actually had to use the outside for during COVID for the restaurant. Mm -hmm. uh, so it just recently moved back upstairs. Okay. Yeah, so you'll be up there okay. in that beautiful view of the course. But um, yeah, just a great spot. People just come by and just have yeah. a cup of coffee, grab something and, you know, watch cars. Yeah, yeah so you don't have to have an appointment. Uh, you can just come in. So, okay. Yeah, so especially being right off the freeway. With LA traffic, a lot of people will pull over. <laughs> yeah. 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 And if we just go down this way, um, I will show you. And again, we do a lot of events here, so we have all different size rooms of the event space. That's uh, Elizabeth's specialty. Their <laughs> 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 world, and you'll see the different tracks. Wow. From everywhere. Obviously, ours is in the center here. Wow, it's big. Mm hmm. Huh. Lots out there. The center are the low friction modules. The outers are the high friction. That acceleration straight runs parallel to the 405 freeway. When we go upstairs, there's a wonderful balcony up there and you can see um, in front of the course pretty well. Wonderful. Yeah. This is awesome. Yeah, you guys definitely have to do the young driver experience. Yeah. Let's yeah. do it. That's gonna be, yeah, <laughs> that'll be fun. Keenan, Keenan won't have to be uh, convinced. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sold. <laughs> This is our new vehicle delivery studio. Oh, beautiful. Um, oh, wow. We wow. have been doing like two deliveries a day for quite a while. So if you purchase a Porsche at a dealership, you can have it delivered here. And we do a four hour celebration. Wow. Yeah, so um, they do a whole unveiling, lots of pictures. Uh, you get to sign a star. Uh, it also includes the 90 minute drive experience and also um, lunch at the restaurant upstairs. Oh wow. Yeah. So Charles Turner, our new vehicle delivery specialist, just makes it super special. He just throws in a lot of special touches in between and makes it really a, a memorable experience. So actually one is right uh, out there now um, and we have a second delivery this mm. afternoon. <laughs> yeah, so lots of fun in there. Yeah, it was actually a very emotional day getting back up there with the restaurant. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah it was, it's been a long journey as it has been for everybody. Um, but to have it back upstairs is wonderful. This is sweet. This is sweet. <laughs> actually, have you guys noticed like a lot more kind of people specking their cars a lot like more differently, kind of adding a bunch like more PTS colors and stuff? Yes. There's yes. been a big uprising now, right? Very big uprising that's uh, very big actually, yeah. yeah. Even in Windsor, we're getting a lot of like Miami blue, 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 like a ton of different colors. So it's yes. cool to see that people All are really- the blues, the lizard green. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It's a private dining room. Oh, wow. Private lunches and dinners. Beautiful. That's awesome. Yeah, <laughs> Thank you. Nice. So out here is really where you can get a good overview of the whole track. Good place. The whole thing. Mm -hmm. So the two cars coming down, you'll see that's our handling circuit. So we'll come do a loop here and then go all the way around back and then come over here and do another loop on the side. Not exactly Grand Bend Motorplex. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit different. <laughs> so really like it's not a racetrack, it's where drivers development. Yeah. So with the, just like in Atlanta with the different modules, you're learning different you're learning car control and just different weather and road conditions. Yeah, more of like a lapping Very circuit good. kind of thing. Mm -hmm. yeah. Exactly. This is awesome. Nice. We gotta come back here and do a car mm -hmm. over here. Actually just last week we did like a video with a uh, 992 Turbo S cab. 
Oh my god, the launch control? Oh. That thing is just stupid. It's beyond words, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, still today, the instructors will come inside and just shake their heads yeah. going, it's yeah. such a yeah. beast. It makes like you sick. That. It literally makes you sick and so fast. It's so intense. Yeah. And yeah. Um, <laughs> launch control also in the Tycon Turbo S, you know, it's a 750 horsepower. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, in that G-Force in itself, oh. there's no hesitation at all. I felt like I was gonna take off. Yeah, <laughs> off we the, drove a, in the uh, air. We drove a take on Turbo S, and uh, we did some like on ramps and stuff. Like in Canada, we have like big loops and everything, and we were doing like 150, 200 around them, and it held like nothing. Like nothing. Well, kilometers around. Yeah, <laughs> not miles, <laughs> but uh, it was unreal. Oh, yeah. And that's the acceleration straight on your left again. That oh, okay. runs parallel to yep. the 405. That's gonna be worth some money. <laughs> so we're gonna go hit the simulators now. Yeah. I've never raced on a simulator. Oh, this fantastic. Is my first time. <laughs> oh my gosh, really, Kiga? Yeah. Oh, this is great. Perfect. Yeah, it's so much fun. Oh, yeah. Uh, Laguna Seca is a great track. Okay. Um, I got to go to Laguna Seca. You know, every five years is when they do the Porsche Run Sport reunion. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and I got to go, uh, what is it now, three years ago? Oh my gosh, 80,000 Porsches there. 80,000 80, 80, people, but almost that many Yeah, yeah probably. Whole Every lot. Porsche on the planet really? is there. <laughs> so, and it's such a large event, that's why they don't do it yearly. We have five sim pods in our lab. Holy. <laughs> I love their faces. Looks exactly like Atlanta. Yeah. Very similar. Yeah. Very similar. Very similar. As you can see, you can pick trucks from around the world and whatever car you'd like to drive, and whatever right. track you pick, if you pick the same track, you can race each other. Let's so, do it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So whenever you guys want to jump on there, uh, Edward's ready, so. All right, so we just finished on the simulators. That was my first time. But Alex won, of course. He's, he's got a lot more experience than us, but it was a lot of fun. It was a really cool. All right, so we're currently out for lunch at the Porsche Experience Center, and look at this view. You've got the track, you've got the drift pad, you've got all the cars lined up. This is. And actually, we already cut it up, but the butter is shaped like a Porsche as well. Check that out. Yeah, we cut it up a little bit, but it is shaped like a Porsche, I promise you. So yeah, this is a great spot to have lunch if you're ever in LA. All right, so we just finished up with uh, lunch. Check out this lineup. These cars are about to go for a drive. We got Panameras, we got Taycons, Carreras, 911s, uh, GT3, another GT3, another GT3. This is unbelievable to see all the cars lined up, but uh, yeah, so it was a pretty cool day. We saw the uh, museum, there's a GT1 in there, and we went to the simulators. That was my first time on it, and I did fairly well, and then the lunch here was delicious. So this is a great place to come and have lunch, spend the day, you know, the track, the skid pad, the simulators, everything. This is an awesome place. All right, everyone, thanks for watching. Go follow our socials, at Car Combine, on TikTok, Instagram, Facebook. So uh, next video, you'll see us at the Peterson Museum, followed by The Vault.